Good evening. In last week, I've read three chapters about the book, The Happiness Project. The chapter seven, chapter eight, and chapter nine. Which is the most interesting chapter for you? But in my opinion, I very like the chapter eight. The chapter eight is talk about the eternity, contemplate the heavens. In this chapter, the time is August. Mrs. Rubin decided to get a family vacation. In this vacation, Mrs. Rubin read a lot of book related to the catastrophe, and、uh, she want to. Uh, imitate a spiritual master. So finally, she chose a person named Mrs. Teresa, the Saint Teresa. Why choose this person as her spiritual master, the Saint Teresa? When she was 15 years old, she become a nun and、uh, went to a convent. And then she died in her twenty-four years old. The most part、uh, attract the Mrs. Rubin is Saint Teresa acted to be happy and let the people around she around her be happy. So this chapter is very meaningful. I strongly suggested you. To read this chapter carefully, then I want to share some sentence, the impressive sentence to you. The first is, all of all meaningfulness meditations, that on death is supreme. Two, happy family are all alike, but every happy family is. Unhappy in its own way. Three, third splendid truth: the days are long, but the years are short. Four, gratitude is important to happiness. Happiness is a how, not a what; a talent, not an object. Five, I set out to intimidate Teresa. By doing a bad job of acting happy, when I know that my happiness would make someone else happy, I didn't want to be fake, but I could make an effort to be less critical. The last one is: it is easy to be heavy, hard to be light. Thank you.